And what is going on, everybody? The zombie survivalist coming here with the Black Ops 3 multiplayer beta. Wow. Sorry about my cat sneezing in the background, but Jesus Christ, guys, I didn't think this was going to be available. But let's go. I'm not. I'm not a big fan of Call of Duty anymore. Um, I'm not dank enough for Call of Duty, so I had to chill out on the memes. But remember, guys, 420 Blaze. But look, I mean, the main, the launch name looked pretty cool. But I'm just gonna scroll through this because every specialist, so click this. Oh, so we collect. Okay, okay, so we select our own little thing, I guess. So he's locked. Okay, so these people have their own little thing. Post some of the all enemies within a range. Nope, escape back. I like this. Unlock and equip. Awesome. So I'm just kind of doing a short little review because I don't. I want this in death, but um, uh, no, I don't want it too long or too in death. In depth, whatever. Menu. Can I change options? Do I have graphics? Okay. Um, refresh rates. Not 50 hertz. I don't know why it's detecting as 50 hertz when it's not. Brightness. Field of view. I can't have it that low or I'll get AIDS. So I'm going to turn it to 70 ish. Uh, drive PS. Maybe you guys can see the type of frame rate I'm getting. Uh, PC specs. FX 8350. 8 core at overclocked to 4.2 gigahertz, R9 270 overclocked, and 8 gigs of RAM. I'm recording this on a slow hard drive, so um, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to upload this in 60 FPS, but it should be in 40 FPS. So, personally, I'm going to crank up my all my graphics settings on the highest thing possible, because Call of Duty usually isn't that um, high of a demanding game. So, ambient occlusion, we can turn this off because that does kill frames on AMD, in my opinion. So, we're going to apply this. Alright. Screen break. Should adjust the resolution of 3D scene rendering. Reduce and improve performance. So, I'm just going to keep that default, to be honest. Audio, we do need to turn down sound. Uh, all this will probably be edited. Um, all this will probably probably be edited uh, first, so my voice will be higher than this. Subtitles, let's go ahead and turn those on. Turn this up just a little bit more. Back. Back. Um, create a class. Let's go ahead and edit up our class. Primary. Okay, so we can change custom stuff the first thing, which is nice. Man of War, damage, fire rate. So this seems to... Let's see, accuracy, fire rate, accuracy. I would usually like the uh, fire rate over accuracy, but we'll go with the Arc 7. Optics, of course, no optics are available. That does kind of make sense. Secondary, rocket launcher. Let's see what we got for pistols. Let's go ahead and equip the pins, uh, pistol. Frag grenade, of course, default. Perks, afterburner. Thrusters have faster recharge. Afterburner, we'll go with that. Um, I have seen trailers for this. I haven't seen lots of gameplay, but I did see my friend stream this on the PS4. Yeah, yeah, okay, so all this is hip fire weapon. Hip fire weapon deployment. Yeah, definitely. So. Uh, I did read some reviews on it, and apparently the game is not that optimized, but we're just going to hop into a match and see what happens. Uh, TDM. Yeah, we'll go with TDM. Found the match already. Wow. <laughs> Black Ops versus CDP. Now, in the case that my frame rate does suck really bad, uh, I'll probably edit up some settings in... Uh, DX story down to 48 instead of 60 and change my graphic settings. Um, ooh, getting some freezing. Custom one. Oh, okay. Well, guys, we crashed whenever uh, loading in. 
I'm not sure if this game is developed by Ubisoft or Treyarch. This isn't like a Treyarch thing. Um, screw this. So I'm going to stop recording while we search for a match just because I don't know what happened. I was getting, it looked like my frame rate was decent, like 50, 30. I spawned and saw my gun crash. So I'm going to stop recording this and we'll record once I'm actually in the game. All right. So it's not crashing anymore. I don't know why this looks so blurry. So we are gonna, that just, okay. Um, <laughs> we're gonna edit up some graphics settings real quick. We're gonna change the screen ratio up because it just looks really blurry. I just not realized that oh my god uh um <laughs> I just not realized I was talking so I had to fix that that was kind of embarrassing 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 that was weird why okay Whew. so something doesn't look correct about my resolution at all um my FPS isn't drawing on my right either, like I asked for it to. Ah, my graphics reset back down to uh, lowest. That makes sense. Where's our drive PS thing? Don't think we can draw it in game. I'll have you guys stay updated on what my FPS is. Okay. Oh. Let me stand still for a little bit so I don't freeze. This is... Okay, I like one shot that kid. Okay, this game looks really, really weird for most Call of Duty games. And my mouse... The controls are don't seem really smooth either. That is my frames or my mouse, even. It feels like my sensitivity is really low. Shouldn't be. Um, game looks really, really blurry for some reason. Uh, I'll mess around with the graphics here in a bit. I just want to get some gameplay in. I do like this little jump pack thing and slide thing. I do want to run on some walls, do some run, uh, wall climbing. <sighs> Forgot how much Call of Duty can annoy me. So we're, we're going to hop into the graphics settings just again, because honestly guys, people say graphics might not matter in the game, but for me, they have to be good. Oh, there's Drive PS. Because, I mean, you got to look at that. The field of view is kind of making my eyes bleed, so we're going to turn that up. So yeah, every time I turn my uh, 3D scale up, it's causing that weird dark glitch. So we're going to set that back to when that fixes it. Yeah, it does. Alright, FPS seems to be going smooth. I do see a little bit of screen tearing. You guys might not see it in the video, but I am experiencing some screen tearing. And... Why are guns are doing really high damage? I mean, I like that, but at least it's not hit marker simulator. All right. Kill their Overwatch. Can I wall climb here? Oh, that is cool. Shotguns are cool too. Okay, so this isn't the best uh, review I can uh, tell, obviously, but the game feels clunky. I can tell that they definitely tried updating gameplay and uh, graphics. Definitely the graphics. I can actually... My PC is actually having some type of uh, stress on it. And this is live comm, because you guys can hear me say um a lot, so I'm also trying to focus on playing. I'm actually going to pick up this Man of War because I actually traded out the Man of War for the Ark. I just want to see which one's better. And no, guys, I am not a, 
COD fanboy. Okay, so I think it auto wall jumps for you from what I just saw. I'm trying to actually. Right. Yeah, the rate of fire isn't uh, isn't isn't uh, as high as I'd want it to be. I saw someone. Do I have kill streaks? That's the best part of call. All right. Um, not sure if we had kill streaks or not. That was a grenade. Okay, so I can do some pretty cool stuff. I don't know why. Just oh, this one has a sight on it. All right. So yeah, I can't complain about. It's just that far away objects look really, really, really blurry. My AA is completely cut up. Pulse vision. I don't know what that was all about. What in the what was that? Oh, that was the bow. Okay, that was cool. <laughs> Should have saw that coming, rip. Okay, yeah. Like, I hate talking about uh, only graphics, but I mean, I guess I'm doing the graphics part. I mean, that just looks really ugly. It's making my eyes hurt. Gameplay right now? Clunky. Very clunky, but I also can uh, kill people pretty easily. I, this is my first game, and I'm going even. First game. I promised you guys I haven't played it. I saw that it was uh, available for download, and my internet speed is 220 megabytes, so I downloaded it, you know, fairly fast. Okay, so you do take fall. Oh. You do take fall damage if you uh, jump from too high, which I mean, it's not too high of fall damage, but I guess it is, does make sense. Okay, so the wall running is pretty cool. It's pretty dank, I guess. I'll uh, I'll do another match, and we're gonna go back to the main menu to see if we unlocked anything or along those lines. These graphics remind me of Dead Island 2 for some reason. Don't know why. So I went positive my first game. 13 kills, 12 deaths. I don't know why my name is that. Don't ask. Don't ask, guys. Don't ask. I can't open up Steam for some reason, so I can't change it anyways. Oh, God. That's embarrassing. If you guys are wondering, I'm working on making my own CSGO gambling site. It's almost done. I'll be making a video on that soon. All right. Arc levels at, uh, level 2. Reflex site plus 100 XP. All right, continue, create a class. We're gonna add a reflex site onto this. Hmm, all right, fair enough. Sites are awesome. And while we're doing that, we'll do some more options regarding, uh, can I even, yeah. So, brightness. Field of view that could be that could definitely use some increasing, definitely. Um, I can turn down this. I gotta stop recording as I get in game, or I can crash. So I'll meet you guys once I get in game. I don't feel comfortable recording while loading in, so I stopped recording there. Don't know if I was able to say it or not. Oh my god, the lag on this map! All right, 40 FPS recording at 30. All right, all right, all right. We gotta do some something to the graphics here in a bit. Shotguns. All right. So, of course, obviously, I need to do something to my graphics real quick. Uh, it's just not 
working out right now so we're gonna change everything down one this can go to that even though it's already looks like you can use use more aliasing we're gonna turn it down just for sakes of FPS all right here's a good mix right here I'm getting you know good enough I probably will buy this when it comes out, especially for the zombies. The zombies are my favorite thing from Treyarch games. Can't find anyone. That was fast. Rip mouse? I don't know what happened there, but the sensitivity does not feel right, so I do weird stuff when aiming. Uh, I'll mess with those settings later, I guess. Rocket launchers are awesome, I guess. Ooh, the shotguns are... Shotguns are, uh... <laughs> does not... Need, definitely needs a, uh... Needs a nerf, because... In a game as fast-paced... As they're trying to do... The, uh... The knife think it's annoying. I'm just looking at my watch to see what time it is right now. HTXD is not like the RCXD. Let's do a vision pulse here. Nothing. Oh. 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 Okay, so yeah, it was the R or R A H C X D, whatever they want to call that. That just quick scoped me, so. Okay, hit markers? <laughs> you were doing good earlier with the damage models. Now it seems like further range does have a like a further damage multiplier range, which I'm not liking at the moment. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think he was praying to Jesus. I like the. Oh. I like that gun too. Oh, Jesus Christ, that just gave me a heart attack. So we can lean, but that was something from ghosts. Oh, rip. Oh, snap. Okay. The vision boost helped me better than she took me out. The, the shotgun. Sorry, I was quiet for a little bit. I was just kind of focusing. But those um shotguns are just not working out with a game this fast pace. Imagine being a scout in Team Fortress 2 and your shotgun one hits everyone. I can admit that the gun models look really nice. And yes, being able to sprint and fire at your shotgun at the same time definitely needs a uh, nerf. But I see why they did beta now. Imagine if this was day like launch, uh, like this on launch uh, day one, where people actually paid to enjoy good Call of Duty experience. Uh, hello, aim. Where are you? 
I cannot aim, guys. I'm terrible, but... Yeah, we're going negative now. I think first match was beginner's luck. Oh! That was a fast match. Alright, guys. I think that's all I'm gonna do for now. I mean... <laughs> I mean, what can I say? I mean, some of the reviews were right. I mean, the frames are not the best. The graphics are good. A lot of people are complaining of not being good, but they do make your eyes bleed a little bit. Turning down my anti-aliasing actually helped with that. I think it just created a overpowered blurred effect that tricked my eyes. Um, guns are really bounced. Assault rifles could do more damage at further range. Shotguns, nerf. Nerf the shotguns, please. Jesus Christ. Other than that, I mean, there's not much to say. For a Call of Duty game, I mean, this is pretty standard, especially for multiplayer. I'm just hyped for zombies. Uh, comment if you guys want to see more beta gameplay. I'm not sure how long the beta is going to be out for, but if you guys are interested, just comment, like, and see you guys in the next video.